Hey guys, it's your boy Astro DK here again with another Red Dead Redemption 2 walkthrough episode for y'all. So we just settled camp. I'm gonna do some exploring. Bro, people talk to you and you can like respond and accept missions from them. It's pretty cool. Let's let's donate some money, y'all. How much should I give? I'll give a dollar. So I'm guessing you, uh, if you don't help around the camp, like, it gets worse around here, probably. Maybe after lunch, hey? Morning. What's up, bro? We can, we got crafting. I'm very into my crafting at the moment, Mr. Morgan. I'm very happy to make you something if you bring me the right materials. Bro, look at the detail, y'all. Different satchels. Appreciate it, we have nothing right now. Here we are. Good morning. Another day old. Let's see, we got some food right here. Which one's the food? Oh, this is just donate food. Getting real low on meat here. I'll give him some stringy meat. No, it's better than nothing, Pearson. There you go, big. I'm helping everybody out. What's this? Can't do anything over here. Oh, we got a photograph. What does it say? I have no idea. The detail though is crazy. Let's move, let's move! I'm hungry, very, very hungry. Is there some food over there? Eating, bro. We gotta eat. Fire. You're Arthur, right? My name ain't no concern of yours. I'm hungry. I don't give a damn. <laughs> <laughs> then you ain't a good judge of character. Oh, yep. See you later. We could play cards with this guy over here. Unfortunately, y'all, I'm sorry to disappoint. I don't know any card games. Uh -oh! I know y'all are cussing me out. I apologize. What is this? Guns? This shit looks hella dirty back here. Let's get on my horse and let's head somewhere. Oh, it's dominoes. Interesting. Wow, boy. Nice, boy. Where should we go, y'all? Do we have a map? That's changing. There we go. Whoa. We could talk to Uncle real quick. Let's see what he wants. Ow! Whoa, whoa! Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. I'm so, weak. While the rest of us are busy stealing. Killing, lying, fighting to try to survive. You <laughs> get to think all day. Yeah, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Moore. Ah, hell no. Nah. You want to head into town? See if we can find anything else. Sure. Let's go to I town, boys. Woo! Great. 
Go check the horses are ready. If you gonna take the old man into town, you can take us too? Well, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> well, can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a robin. You're worried about house chores. Hell Let's not. Go. Fair enough. You got me. Come on, man. <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah. Civilization. <laughs> y'all better keep to y'all selves and not cause trouble. Okay, then. Let's go. All right. Out to the trees here, then take a left. Oh, watch out. You hear me? Let's go to first person mode, y'all. Whoa. What's going on over here? I'll be right back. All right, I'll see what's going on. Lumbago, really. You all right there, friend? Oh, hey, you couldn't help me get my other horse back from over there, could you? Where'd it go? I'd really appreciate the help. I I'm worried this one here will bolt on me, too, if I leave him. Yo, where did the other horse go? It went right. Turn on, Arthur. Oh, there he is. I was tripping. Easy, easy. It's okay. Good boy. Easy, you're all right. This way. Come on. We did it, boys. We tamed a horse. Hopefully no train comes. I'll be fucked up. Gentlemen, sir. A gentleman. No, not really. I was just no, trying to impress go. the women. I was trying to impress the women. I'm weak. <laughs> You're turning into a regular old fairy godmother there, Arthur. What's that supposed to mean? It means you got a heart. A small one, perhaps, hidden deep. Nah, I just do what's right sometimes, y'all. Don't get me wrong. I'm about to be robbing people. Well, Arthur, I'm proud of you. To be honest, you lot hadn't been here. I'd have kept on going. I'm weak. <laughs> We're in town, y'all. This is crazy. Smell those sheep. Or is that uncle? 
people very I'm funny. weak. This looks like a decent little town. Other people, finally. Look at all that snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us. I'm weak. Or to do any real work. She's a society lady now. Okay. Take a good look around, ladies. See what we got here. Go left here, down the main street. There's always on the right. Oh, boy. Sure you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Heaven forbid you put your head on the line. Yeah, well, that's a young man's game. <laughs> Let's go find us some bounties, y'all. We can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Hell yeah. Do you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably not. not. Ah, called it! Woo! Near the stable. Bro, I am Arthur Morgan, y'all. It's confirmed. Can't believe it. Here we are, just like I said, cultural center of civilization. <laughs> Man at his finest. Uncle, what are we doing? Well, we're going to do what any self-respecting maniac does. Put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble. Don't get yourselves noticed. Right, I need to get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll see you at the general store when you're done. Come on, ladies. Imagine we're in Paris. I imagine Paris. So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna ask why. The one-shot kid, I'm weak. sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. Haha. <laughs> Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I'm so fucking weak. I lied. <laughs> Ringworm. Then rats with the plague. Then uncle. Then you. Ah! Uh, this is the place now. Come on. Let's go then. So, what we got some need? candy. Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. You know, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Always thinking ahead, ain't you? You're looking a bit tired there, Arthur. You got some chocolate. Why don't you pick up some coffee while we're here? Let me know if you have any questions, fellers. Whiskey's on the top shelf, nearest the door. Where's the... Where's the... Coffee at? We got some lotion? I don't want no You're damn not lotion. not getting anything, Arthur? Uh, I don't know. Maybe. We got some oat cakes. We got some salted beef. So, you're actually buying for once? Are you feeling all right? See this? Young folk got no respect for their elders no more. What do you reckon? I'm Wham weak. Or the sausage? Well, this here's Does the anything in here seem cool? Oh, we got coffee, y'all. I know what the smell is. Well, that's a ripe cheese, all right. Okay, if you're done, I'll meet you outside. I won't be too long. Do we need anything else? Let's get some oat cakes. Ah, <laughs> this should do the trick. Yep, that's fine whiskey. That should do us. Let's go wait for them outside. Four dollars for some oat cakes? Oh, Damn, that shit's fellowship. expensive as hell. Your good health, sir. <laughs> and to being down here off that mountain. Absolutely. Got some whiskey, y'all. It's a funny world, you know. This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. I fell asleep. Gentlemen, I think I got something good. What? What? I snuck into this fancy house. Acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Denis and then cruising off to Brazil. Hell yeah. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night. 
as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yes, oh, boys. Woo! Yeah, yeah, it's right out in their new Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Uh, Where's Tilly and Karen? I think at the hotel, they were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? It seemed easy. They have been gone for quite a while. Oh no, Guess guys. I'll go see if there's any trouble. Oh, there's Tilly over there. Oh that shit. Does not look ideal. Excuse me. We gotta handle this, y'all. Get your hands off me. You thought I wouldn't find you, Tilly. Huh? You can go kiss a damn snake for all I care. Get off me. Get off of me. I've been on. Get your hands off mm. her, friend. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get off her. <laughs> What's up, bitch? Or what exactly? I'm about to punch the fuck out of you, dog. Get moving. You're making a big mistake. Get moving, Jackson. bitch. Get lost. Get the fuck out of here. Go right away with now. Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. We protect our own around here. Well, anyways, guys, I think this is where I'm gonna end it for this episode. Uh, if you liked it, please leave a like down below. If you guys are excited for this series, please subscribe. You know, I upload multiple episodes every single day. At least I try to. Um, if you guys have any suggestions, please leave it down in the comments down below. But other than that, guys, yeah, I'm super excited to continue this game. Uh, we're going to make sure Arthur Morgan uh, is a savage in this game. We're going to be playing as a badass bandit. You already know. What the fuck? She scared the hell out of me. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching this episode again, and uh, until the next one, peace out.